The 1975 frontman Matty Healy opted to arrive for his set in an unconventional manner last night, July 9. The rockers were closing the final day of Glasgow's TRNSMT festival when Healy was brought on stage in a striking red biffa wheelie bin. Dressed in a doctor's coats and glasses, the band began their set with looking for somebody, to love, from their latest album being funny in a foreign language. The band also revealed Scottish singer Lewis Capaldi was watching the set from backstage. It came just weeks after he cancelled his tour to focus on his own health. Louis Capaldi in tears as he admits to hating himself Healy said, Our good friend Louis Capaldi is joining us this evening. He is watching backstage. Healy revealed that his band, which formed in 2002, will replace Capaldi as the headliner at the Reading and Leeds Festival. He said, Film this because I'm not going to do an Instagram post. I'm not on the social media anymore, so people know. So, on Saturday at Reading and Sunday at Leeds in celebration of 10 years of our debut album The 1975, we will be playing that album in full in support of our good friend Louis Capaldi. Don't miss! Lana Del Rey addresses that controversial Glastonbury performance, latest, class never goes out of style. The stylistics think enthusiastic British fans, report, blurs Damon Alburn Wow's crowd in iconic Fila jacket, news, Healy also referenced his past issues with drugs after playing the song Love Me. He said, that really highlights when you're not on drugs. Why would you want to put a wall between it? This is f amazing. Thank you so much. This means so much to us. We f love Glasgow. We are very happy to be back. Rock duo Royal Blood and pop star Becky Hill played the main stage before the 1975. And on the King Tut's stage, the enemy frontman Tom Clark told the audience where he bought his first guitar. Clark said, we're only four songs in and already this is f amazing. About 15 years ago, we were playing at the Barrow Langs over there and after sound check, I went to the Barrow Langs market and I bought this guitar. TRNSMT replaced the T in the Park Festival in 2017 after its demise left a gap in the Scottish music calendar for the second weekend in July. Around 50,000 people attended on each day of the three-day music extravaganza. On Sunday, Police Scotland confirmed there had been 14 arrests over the first two days.